Hey there, welcome back to Pocket Code Tutorials. My name is CodeGreen01, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to build a proper functioning pen version 2.0. And uh, yeah, guys, this video wouldn't have been possible if it wasn't thanks to Wolfgang. So, thanks, Wolfgang. So, what happened is Wolfgang took my code uh, from my last video, uh, how to build a proper functioning pen, and he, he basically simplified the crap out of it. You got, guys, I'm telling you, it's going to blow your minds when you see it, okay? Like, if you've seen the last video, your mind's will be blown. Let me just put it like that. Okay, so let's get into this uh, project and let's look at the pen scripts. So what happens here is, uh, basically it'll set the transparency of the object to 100%, set the color to black, and uh, yeah guys. And if you remember, let's disable this brick real quick and take a look at the program. In my last video, I explained when you start using the pen, it looks like an etching sketch, okay? Um, every time you try to touch somewhere else on the screen, it'll touch your, uh, it'll connect a black line from your last touch point, and that's annoying. So I'm gonna show you guys how to remove that effect. So let's go back and re-enable this point one second, and I'm gonna get into more depth on how this works. So this is the whole script right here, guys. Dang! Yeah, so much more simplified than my last one. So now if we take a look at it, uh, what happens is the object will go to its touch position and it'll wait 0.1 seconds and then the pen will be put down on the paper. After that, you guys can see this repeat until brick and what is inside it says not screen is touched. So how do we write that out? We go into logic, not, device, touch detection, screen is touched. And what happens here is basically it'll run go to touch position inside, repeat until break, until basically the screen is not touched anymore. And at the end of this loop, the pen will come up. So let's now take a look at this code in the program and see how it functions now. As you guys can see, it works so much better. You can draw properly. Wow, so much better. <laughs> okay guys, if you enjoyed this tutorial, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you're new, hit that bell notification icon so you don't miss out on any of my new content. Keep your brain juices flowing guys. Thank you Wolfgang for showing us how to do this. And uh, yeah guys, your boy CodeGreen01, signing out.